Historic community staple in Royal Oak is on the chopping block. The main art theater has been a beacon of independent cinema for 80 years, but plans to tear it down have sparked a rally from community members desperate to find a way to keep it standing. In June of 2021, the building's former out of state tenants closed the theater permanently, sparking this marquee display by theater staff. 7 Action News reporter Jen Shans is hearing from the people fighting to save it and what the building's developers want to see happen. I feel this is one of the things that has remained the same throughout all the changes in this city. Longtime Royal Oak resident Nancy Greenia isn't opposed to change, but she also doesn't want to see history lost. She's joining a growing list of people and businesses in Royal Oak trying to save the main art theater. If this place were to be demolished, what do you think the city would lose? Oh, I think it would lose a great opportunity to do something different, to get outside of the box. If the space were to be saved, it could be used to offer film production or screenwriting classes. Some of the many ideas of Friends of the Main Art, a nonprofit that formed this summer after news spread that the theater might be raised. There's also talks of including a smaller micro cinema in the new development, one way to keep the spirit of this place intact. Like 50 to 100 seats in a one screen space with the possibility of a side room of about 50 seats. But nothing is certain. The group says they're in conversations with the developers. Ideally, they want to see the theater, which opened back in 1941, saved altogether. In my mind, demolition, and development does not always equate with progress. The building's owners submitted these development plans to the city commission last week, seeking to turn the property into a five story mixed use space to include retail housing and office space. In the renderings, the historic marquee of the theater remains. For people like Maine Arts president Jason Krizyak, it's a bit of a sting, the marquee remaining without the theater. This fight for him is a personal one too. For years, he came here with his family to see indie films, cult classics, or foreign works not usually available at traditional theaters. Our goal, short term, enter into a lease agreement with the property owners and run this as a community-driven theater. They've seen it work in other Michigan cities and are hopeful the site's developers keep an open mind so that this theater may open its doors once again. We have people thanking us for contacting them because this theater not only supports our love of independent film, but it supports the community. Friends of the Main Art is hosting a rally right here Saturday, April 9th. And I did reach out to the building's owner for a comment. We're hoping to hear back soon. We'll post that response on our website, WXYZ.com. In Royal Oak, Jen Shantz, 7 Action News.